Welcome back, everybody. Woo! We, um... We accidentally talked to Waka, and yep. there was, like, a two-second thing. It was talking about this. this yeah. The, the secret place. Ooh, the secrets. Uh, what secrets do you hold? What secret lie in the hearts of uh, men? Yeah, that's a creepy rock. Yeah, it's, it's, it's rock face. Was it all poppers? And then there's no... Oh, oh, go back. Go back, go back, go back. So... That's a dog uh -huh. barking a person out mm -hmm. or kind of like what you might expect a bee with Sora's head would look like at four in the morning when you are high off your asses from okay. the mold growing in your friend's walls. Um, Shooting out the freaking cards. Yep. Okay. And so there was this, this weird invention that my friends had. Where it was a shotgun that shot out dogs that barked bees that stung lasers. Okay. And we fucking lost our minds on this shit for hours on end. It was like, what if there was a shotgun that like shot dogs? Oh, and the dogs barked bees. Oh, and the bees stung lasers everywhere. Jesus. <laughs> oh man, there was something. Oh, and Is there's that look, Donald. That's Donald, and there's the wizard hat. And look, uh -huh. so there's there's Sailor Donald with like, like the, the little propeller hat. Yeah. Or or goofy, and then there's evil wizard Donald. Nice. Yeah. No, there there had to be some. Right. Oh, this there is the it important is. One. Oh, there it is. I wonder why there is door leads. Mushroom. I got a mushroom. Oh. Is this where I draw on the wall that I want to share a fruit with her? Press faces against each other. I want to... You draw the person that you like, and I'll draw the person that I like. Uh, Alright, go! This totally isn't a child. Just a piece of toast. <laughs> <laughs> and then she has like... I like pancakes. Pancake. Pancookin. What, what are you... Oh, I'm yep. feeding her the fruit. That's The symbolism right. of my love. Who's there? Oh, shit. I've come to see the door to this world. Huh? This world has been connected. Oh, you're this not is, creepy at all. This is this is Biff, about? isn't it? Biff? Biff. Uh, what's his name? From uh, to Back to the Future, who then like kind of became like the voice of uh, well, some other... Oh, you did know he, what? Did he do a voice in this game? I don't... I didn't think he did. We're looking it up. All right. When, like, we're just going to go to the internet machines. What lies beyond? Uh, Kingdom Hertz. So you're from another world. There is so very much to learn. Like, listen to the, the bass on that voice. So little. Oh, yeah. I'm just gonna well, talk see. really low into the microphone and, what's out there. and make love with it. Effort. My voice is so deep One that it reverberates in the back of your ear. Nothing. And it causes an ASMR-like effect. This guy is really creepy. Oh my goodness. So... First off, I'm going to readjust my microphone, everybody. I'm sorry. Uh, we have Haley Joel Osment yep. as the voice of Sora. With Hayden Panettiere as the voice of Kyrie. Really? Yeah. Huh. Neat. Uh, David Gallagher as Riku slash Riku Replica. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. The voice of Ensem, Billy Zane. Who's Billy Zane? I feel like I know that name, but I don't know that name. You would recognize him by looking at him. From such movies as? Uh, Zoolander. Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah, you definitely, like, you know, you would know Billy Zane, everybody, if you saw him. Uh, he was the fiancé to What's-Her-Name in Titanic. Okay. Yeah, the, ma the main love interest. Uh... Dude, 
I, Miku and I are one and one. Yeah, we're even. That's because you're all bad. Oh. Murder him. You three against me. Uh... I forget, like, what the best way to handle this is. Uh, isolate? Yeah, you do have to- you have to focus fire one of them, but I forget which one uh, you're- Uh, I believe it would be Titus, because he's the one that comes at you. No, actually, I actually don't think that's the case. Really? I think it's- I think you almost want to focus fire Waka, because he's got- he's the ranged one. Uh, you know, that makes a lot of sense. Like, Can't, focusing range- Like, Titus is easy. No, I don't want to take this. Uh, David Boreanis. That I know. As Squall. Uh, Mandy Moore as uh, Arieth Gainsborn. The Gainsboro. Steve Burton as Cloud. Christy Romano as. as uh, Yuffie. Sean DD. Lance, oh my god. Hmm. Lance Bass. As Sephiroth. As Sephiroth. Uh huh. That is freaking amazing. Ah, uh, let's see here. Uh, I don't even know who's like actual. Oh my god. No. No, 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 no. I don't even know who that was that was just talking to you right now. Do you? No. It might have been Ansem. Oh. <laughs> they got Gilbert Gottfried. Yeah. They did a really good job getting, like, all the old voices. No, they... Oh, I mean, that's probably also because, um... I mean, it's Disney, so, like, spare no expense. Either spare no expense or, hey, by the way, that contract that you sign also permanently locks you in for that voice. Yeah. Oh, James Woods. Heck yeah, James Woods. Oh, oh, I love you, James Woods. Oh no, he no, ran into the James Woods. <laughs> no, I'm gonna lose. Oh. I'm gonna lose. No! Use a potion! I'm not gonna burn a potion on this. Oh. oh. Alright, we've got two of them down. I just gotta. Just gotta. Just gotta, gotta, gotta beat Waka. Beat up Waka. Without, without getting hit again. Yep. Oh! oh. Of course. All right. So, what's the tactic here? Like, what is it? Is it is it take them out like one at a time? Um, yeah, you got to focus fire them down. I think Yuffie was the best. I, I think it ended selfie. up being yeah, selfie being the best one to take out first. Well, I think because she also has like the least amount of defense or oh. the least amount of health. So taking her out is like all you need to do is like get like three good like combos on her. Yeah, and she's down. Because it's, it's, it's your third strike that's, like, the most powerful of them all as well. Yeah. So. All right. Back to the future. Or is it? All right. So she's down. Or is it? What's his name? Ron Perlman. I don't recall Ron Perlman being in this game. Well, me either, but... You know, I'm 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 trying to remember that voice that I heard, because I'm I'm pretty sure I've I've heard that voice before. Thomas F. Wilson is the voice of Biff. All right, all right, we're all doing right. way better this time. Yes, I think the big problem was is like actual focus. Yeah. That's another thing that I remember about this game, too, is, like, they actually had a lot of different, like, they had a really good, like, I don't know if you would call it a case machine, uh, or, um, a state machine, but, um, <clears throat> they had a lot of, like, if you're running and you're not facing towards the opponent and you attack, like, your attack animation was slightly slower versus if you were facing them. Yeah. Like, it, it, it did a really good job to, like, take into account all the weird, like, oh, so you don't even get anything but a potion for beating all three. Oh, yeah. But, um, like, there was a lot of really good, like, like, uh, animation, um, accounting inside of, like, the speed and the style mm -hmm. and, like, your... It, it, it didn't feel, oh, jarring like that. 
I remember correct, yeah, because this is one of those types of games that loves to do this kind of thing. I believe mm -hmm. there's like a race segment that comes up soon. Yes, I believe it's actually where you're heading to right I now. I think so. Because, um, whatchamacallit, stuff and things, things I, I, and stuff. I think the idea is that that's like how you do the whole, like, who gets to share the fruit with. That's, yes, you're absolutely right. Um, well, that didn't, that didn't go well. Oh, that's right. Hmm. I had totally forgotten about this show. Oh. Hey, Rico. The, the Kathy, Kathy Bates um, comedy crime drama TV series. Oh. Called Harry's Law. Uh, a group of misfit lawyers from an unconventional firm, and it has uh, Kathy Bates as Harriet Korn, and she is wielding the 357 a, Magnum. A bloody from, axe. The bloody axe of corn. Yes, the bloody axe of corn. Blood for the blood god. Oh, and it had Brittany well, Snow in it. Guess we're doing this. Hey, how's it going? Hey, Sora. A crafty. How about I would? What, what would you call it? Excalibur. Like, what do you want to call it? You want to call it Excalibur or you want to name it something else? Mm, Brittany Snow. Okay. Let's just name it. How do I, how do I get it? I don't think you can fit Brittany and Snow in there. Let's find out. I'm not far. Oh, wow, Steve. You are really good at that. Actually, I've got more letters to spare. You have one letter to spell. Spare. There. <laughs> mm, oh, because it looks like a snowflake. Yeah. Love Yay! It. We have the Britney Snow. <laughs> <laughs> mm, me? Hmm. Britney Snow. <laughs> <laughs> Britney Snow. Hey, how about the usual? Let's, Let's do, do it. it. Oh, that's right. So yeah. this one teaches you. Like, if you ignore this whole scenario, or what, I, I I don't think you can, actually. If I'm not wrong, right? You can't ignore this. I don't think you can. <clears throat> so, like, this is, this is, like, brilliant game design win, right here. Uh, I'm captain, and if you win, I get to share the pow with Kyrie. Huh? Oh, that's right. Deal? The winner gets to share a pow with Kyrie. Oh, uh, wait a minute. Okay, on my count. Oh, go! Jump! Jump! Jump before the third! Oh, no, wait, you already, you already, uh... Yeah. Set it off, or whatever it is. Because, like, isn't it like if you don't set it off, like... Oh, what the hell? Oh, what the hell, indeed! Like, isn't that supposed to be something that you should be able to do? Yeah, it's supposed to uh, zip line me down. What? Well, that's frustrating. Well, that is extremely frustrating, because you just lost. Pretty much. And isn't it that he just like, oh no, you gotta keep going. Yeah, it's, you have to get back. But oh. I mean, he's like already back. Uh, except he's walking now. Oh, cause the game wants you to win. Yeah. So they, they like, it's more programmed the game to be all like, he's oh, gonna... he's just gonna slow down. Oh no, wait, never no. mind. I guess that was just bad pathfinding for the AI. Yeah. Oh, now the score is one and two. No, the Britney Snow. Not the Britney Snow. Wait. I wonder if you can. What? It's a race. I, will, right. I want that powerful fruit. Well, he even says that it was a joke. Again, like I said, he, he teases you. He knows. See, I honestly never spoke to him after the first time I lost this. Oh, both of you! Um, I, uh, I honestly didn't speak to him after I lost the race, so I oh, never yeah. knew that he was joking around with you. You gotta just, like... Oh, uh, there we go. That's weird, like, detection. It's also weird. <sighs> Ugh! It's almost like it's better to, like, cut him off from there so that way he starts running this way and then yeah. just to outrun him normally. Oh, my God. 
Oh. I'm bad at this. Mm. It's the pressure, Tom. I can't handle the pressure. Can't handle the oh. pressure, even though I ran an entire BlizzCon all by myself. Oh, it's so much pressure. Oh, I yeah, the wall. <laughs> what, what's this? Oh. It's nothing. I mean, nothing compared to this. A race to give my, my digital girlfriend her pow poo fruit. I'll give her a pow poo. I'll give her my pow poo if you know what I'm saying. Uh. I can't take. I can't. No, you can't get the mushroom. You're in the middle of a race, dude. You're in a completely different instance. All active quests are offline. All active quests are disabled until the race for the pow poo fruit is over. 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 Her. Yep, Riku's better than me. Yeah. I'm just going to accept that reality. Yep, we have the high wind and uh, no USS Brittany Snow and no Powerful Fruit with Kyrie. Well, we still get to have the Powerful Fruit with Kyrie. But then we also have to share it with, with Riku. <laughs> I, I don't like that. It'd be hilarious if like it gets to that segment in the game and it's like, all right, do you want to share the Powerful with Kyrie or do you want to share it with Riku? And you're like, I want to share it with you thought I wanted to share this with Kyrie. No, Riku. No, Hidden Penitier. I don't want you. It was Riku all along. Riku for life. I love you, Riku. Riku, best boy. I love how, like, <laughs> how he tap Sora, the like, spanks the thing. He, like, taps it nicely, like, hey, would you open for me? Open, please. Okay! Hi, right, Sora! This is for you! Blech. Blech. And Sora's like, thanks. Yay, protection chain. I got a protection charm. I'm going to put it on right now. Look That's why I have a necklace. Look at my Daffy went up by one. And that is because it protects my wallet. My wallet is now on a John. What was it? Was it was it first kid that Sinbad movie where he's all like the the president's child and he's the bodyguard? Oh god! And the president's child always gets picked on at like the private school that he goes to, uh. and so Sinbad gives him like an exploding wallet or something, uh. and so like the kids walk up and they're like, "We're gonna take your money, rich president kid," and they like grab his wallet and they open it up and it like shoots a fireball or like it like. Fires electricity everywhere and scares the shit out of them. And then Simad's like, yep, that's how you do it. Well, then. I don't know, man. I'm just like, <laughs> I don't know, man. I'm high. <laughs> I'm high as fuck. <laughs> uh, I'm really high right now. I'm real high and I'm getting paranoid. <laughs> so I got to think of happy memories like Simbad. Which, by the way, mm, Simbad. I don't know why. Oh, no, wait, I do know why. Oh, that's where that goes. I always remembered yeah. as a kid, whenever I would see the show, and it was called something like Sinbad and the Seven Seas or yeah. something like that. I know what you're talking I about. I would always see that and be like, oh my God, it's that comedian Sinbad. <laughs> he has his own TV show. Because oh he did God. have a TV show called Sinbad. He did, yeah. And I like clicked on Sinbad in the Seven Seas, and I like was like, "Yeah, it's gonna be Sinbad," and it wasn't. It very much was not Sinbad, and I remember being super disappointed because like it always like it always got me. <laughs> and I, I uh... do I have to keep racing him until I win? Yes. Oh. Um. You you keep raising him, and I'm gonna check my memory. Memory bank scanning. Which like, <laughs> so I wanted to buy a memory book of this game. <laughs> So that Con way I could remember better. Remember, remember the 5th of November. November? November! No. no. F off, Riku. No. Don't no. grab on the thick trunks. Oh, my thick trunk. 
I'm gonna win this. No! You, uh. Um... I was waiting! I'm gonna. I wanted the fruit! No! Oh, no! But I wanted the fruit! C calm, calm down, Steve. No! But how about you? How about you lay back a little bit and no, and, uh, I want the fruit. You just like kick him right in the shin. As he's as he's like jumping. Just what? Like, how? How? Cause he's a sh shader face. He is. God damn, man! I don't remember this race being this hard. That's because you're doing it all wrong. Oh, well. In that case, I guess I'll just fall down here yeah and suck real bad at video games yeah well you know sometimes all right look here riku like we don't want to keep doing this so if you could just let me win that would be great seriously seriously just let us win that it's not a hard concept bro brah like obviously Bruh. i'm not good at this Obviously. If you could just really, like, just give me one, dude. Like, just let me look okay in front of my girl. In front of this girl I'm trying to impress. Just let me look cool, man. I feel like there's gotta be an easier way to do this. Alright, so you're gonna run. Uh-huh. And, and you're just gonna run faster than him. And then you're gonna go to the left. And to then what left. you're gonna do is you're gonna run towards the the stairs to block him so that way he has to go to the right then you're gonna go left and left. jump onto that little lip and then there's a thing that allows you to jump straight across onto those over, palm trees over here no you gotta go to the right you've already messed it up wait you said go to left i said you need to go towards the stairs and then jump on the cliff to the left over here is that what you're talking about no, so watch go there uh-huh and then follow him okay and as you can see there's a path that those things right there to your right, you yeah. can jump on those to go in a straight line towards that uh, star fruit, the star sign. What things? So watch, go that way. Oh wait, you actually might win. Yes, it, just it, continue to casually saunter. No. Saunter. No. saunter, 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 saunter. No! Did I do it? Did I win? Nope. Here, here, hold on. Okay, hold, hold on, here, hold here, on, here, hold here, on. Here, 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 here. No, just, just okay, tell me, so, tell me. So go straight. Now okay. jump. So we're going to go this way. And then you're going to go to the, the, the so those. So go to this, right? To, to cut them off. And cut then you're going to cut straight left. This way? And then go over there to the right. Yeah, you're going to jump up there. It doesn't, it doesn't let me up. Oh, well. Then... You're going to just go up there like normal. Because I could have sworn you could have jumped up there. But... Uh, as you, uh, like, see, you can jump across those. Right. This is all presuming I can actually make these jumps. Yep. Is it is it because of the control? Uh, kind of. It's just one of those, like, this it, is an old game. Yeah. And so, like... Uh, maybe there's, like, a setting you can, you can set and the options. I don't maybe. think so. Maybe you can, like... I don't, I don't think so. I think these yeah. are just, this is just the way this game controls. But yeah, so like you jump on there. But like, cause like your jump is real floaty. Uh, ju See? Your jump is real floaty. Oh, maybe I just have to talk to her. I mean, I don't have to do this race. Hmm? One seagull egg, three mushrooms, two coconuts, three fish. Oh. So we have everything else, right? Uh, I don't think we have everything. I don't know. Check your your items. We have a seagull egg, three mushrooms. We what need we water need? and and something coconut. else. Coconuts, yeah, the coconuts we don't have. Okay, yeah, we don't even have to do the race. Oh my, the race the race is dumb. Ugh. Part of me wants to do the race. Uh, you know what? I don't. Part of me wants to do the race. I think we should do the race, Steve. No, we're not gonna do the race, Tom. It's so entertaining for everybody to watch, though. We <laughs> watch the everybody. Don't you love watching Steve fail? Who doesn't don't you love, just watching, love me? watching Steve fail? Isn't that why you all play Hearthstone? Oh. Hmm. Too mean. A little bit. Oh, I'm sorry, buddy. A little bit. Not for me. 
can't fill the water here? I think you have to go. Yep. Oh my god. I... You were off by like a hundred pixels. Okay. Yeah. All right. I'm good. Let's get them co coconuts. I don't. I don't know where the coconuts are. I think they're upstairs inside of that little room that you went into that was empty. That's right. Like their yeah. their weird little communal sleeping room. Where they all sleep together on this island? Yeah. Well, everybody but Kyrie and Sora. Because they sleep in the cave together. No, I thought they slept in like actual beds. Like, isn't that how he ends up? Oh, yeah. Like, I think they actually, like, weirdly enough, at one point, in fact, when, when everything goes down, I think you actually discover that he does actually have a house, like a regular house. Like, you, like, Sora and Kyrie, for whatever reason, actually live in a house. Right. They actually, like, they have with parents, real and parents and stuff. parents and shit. Yeah. But everybody else is, like, this weird, like, abandoned <laughs> child of. Like, like this island of lost children. Like the the, the freaking island of the flies here. Buzz buzz. And poor piggy. Oh. But like, yeah, your character and Kyrie have freaking families and everything, and then something goes down. Oh. Yeah, you gotta gotta smack them. Gotta, gotta smack them real good. Go pick it up. Pick, pick it up. Pick it. Pick it up. Maybe, maybe you have to like break it. Maybe you can't drop it in the water. Do I just smack other ones for it? Yeah, so smack that one. There. Yep. Maybe maybe there's only certain ones I can take. Maybe. I don't know. Try the other tree. Like that one there. The 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 white the white barked one. That's not a coconut tree. You don't know that. Mean. How do you know that, Steve? Oh yeah, see, there's got to get the grand ones. How do you, how do you know that that one wasn't a coconut tree? Cause look at it. Don't you dare bring up nature in this. Nature. Yeah. Isn't that neat? Isn't, Isn't that, that neat? neat? Oh my God, you would die. <laughs> what do you What do you mean I would die? <laughs> that thing fell on your head. Oh God, I thought you were like commenting on my ability to survive on an island. No, just I like... would die on an island. <laughs> and I was in the Boy Scouts. I thought you were like, God, Steve, you're so bad at getting coconuts. You would die. No, 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 no. That is not even remotely what I was commenting on. <laughs> no, you would probably like, survive. God damn, Tom. You would survive way better <laughs> than I would. Would have called me on my inability to survive on a deserted <laughs> island just because it's taken me forever to get coconuts <laughs> off a tree. I mean, no. The only reason I would even remotely survive is because of the goddamn King of Random. Like, I have learned so oh. much from that dude. Oh, and that one Polynesian guy that I that I saw on his YouTube channel recently. Have I ever shown you that? No. There's a Polynesian dude who owns his own, like, who owns his own, who made his own YouTube oh, channel. I can lock him under the tree. God, that makes my life way easier. Uh... <laughs> There, you got your second coconut. Did Let's need, get out of here. Did I need fish? Oh, you need one fish. Do I even get Where fish? Where do we get fish? Like, do we stand in the water? I feel like it's gotta be out here somewhere, right? Do do we like, why, why would we even need fish? We're in an ocean surrounded by fish. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe you want one to be entertaining and I, um, salty. Uh, anyways. There it is. They're like uh, right there. There's like this Polynesian dude who has his own hey, YouTube channel. Come here. And he literally shows you how to, um... I just need the one, or do I need two? You need There's two, two. fish, so... Get, get both, whatever. Yeah. Um, he teaches you how to freaking husk a coconut with your teeth. Neat. The dude bites through a fucking coconut. All right, what a boss. Yes. And then he cooks a coconut with lava. Well, you know. The dude, we're watching it. everybody at home. You need to go and look for a uh, YouTube dude who like eats coconuts with his bare teeth. You know what? That's very misleading. Uh, She's making a necklace out of throstle shells. There, see this? Uh, that is it. Aww. It is not that. <laughs> he husks a coconut with his teeth. So. Go on YouTube, search 
How to Husk a Coconut, and it's by a YouTube channel called Polynesian Cultural. Uh, mm. It is so freaking cool. The dude on there is the most charismatic dude I've ever, like... Oh, I need one more fish? Ugh. Oh, this is... is no, there was one right behind you. No, it's not a fish. It's, yes, it is. It's a starfish. It's still a fish! It doesn't count. Is it not salty enough? No. Alright, I'm gonna call fish and come, have him come over so we can give him to Kyrie. I understand now why fish is so salty. Yeah, well, he lives he in lives the ocean. In, yeah. Damn it! Ah, I stole your joke! You were fast enough! Ah. Uh, uh, you commenting on my inability to beat Riku in a race? Uh, yes. Probably wonders. So, like, just kind of coming here, right? So mm -hmm. we start off. Probably wonders if it's better to just not even jump on that and just be like, okay. I mean, give it a shot. Have fun. Go! Race! 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 Really doing race. this again? We're gonna do this again. I could add the word war at the end of my comment right now. <laughs> do you want to go there? No. Because, <laughs> uh, so bad. Let's see. Go ah. off the border. <laughs> Run by your own rules, Sora. <laughs> off the beaten trail. I'm Sora. And these are the Sordas. Because they're sort of like me. Get it? Get, get it. All right. Sadness oh, fills and, my belly. I'm uh, gonna go and start up the, the, the kingdom uh, heart. Hey. hey, you're stuck there until I'm done. Ha 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 ha. Stupid computer. 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 Oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> It worked! The simplest it path was worked. the best! Life hack! <laughs> now the score's two, two to six! six. <laughs> I got a priest though! <laughs> Woo! Wow! We won, Woo. everybody! <laughs> wow! And we will see you in the next episode! Oh, the simplest path was the best! Bye! Bye!